right? That's why you can read a bunch of self-help books and still be in the same pattern. You didn't do anything but collect information. But how do I get to the inner part of you? So Inception, our mental health gym, is about altered states of relaxation because that's how you get the body to calm, calm down and, and come out of these defense mechanisms is through deep states of relaxation, right? And when that can happen, see, a lot of you, I'm going to tell you, I, I've, I've been observing a lot of stuff and since I've been here. Like, I've never been around speakers, but I, I know that game. And a lot of you are using a lot of willpower. You can be successful, but if you don't sleep well, I don't know what you're talking about. I don't hear you, right? If pastor's talking about spirituality, but you don't sleep well, I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> you can't quiet your mind down, I don't know what you're talking about. Because from what I know, God is in a, a still, small, quiet space. And you can't hear nothing when that mind is just a monkey mind. It's too much going on. That's why when we get into the float tank, look, you get into that float tank when there's nothing in there. No light, no sound, no gravity. When, you, when your brain reaches that deep state of relaxation, there's no thing, nothing but you, right? And that's when you connect to the nothingness, to the darkness. The darkness has a bad rap. Think about it. We always talk about the light. I'm in the light, I'm in the light. What are you talking about? You spent nine months in your mother's room in nothing but darkness. When we put seeds in the ground, what do you think is under there? It ain't the light. What Bane say from Batman? The darkness. You're born in the darkness. You're born in the darkness. So when you're in that darkness, that's when you're able to reset and become one with that nothing and hear that small, quiet voice, right? That you, that you've missed. But you have to get the instinctual part of you because, again, you're stuck. You're stuck in these patterns, and we got to get that to calm down so you can relax. And then all of a sudden, if you're speaking and you're a pastor and all these things, you're not using all this willpower. Y'all using willpower to do this stuff. Like, you got to use your brain power, which is, one, there's a Chinese proverb that says that tension is who you think you are, but relaxation is who you really are.